this video lecture i am going to discuss what how to run dot sql file in oracle sql developer okay so the first thing is that you need to find where is the file path or dot sql so this is your c user then after or uh, user adam so this place you can see this is the dot sql file so if i right click then if I go on the properties, then you can see dot SQL that's come there. Okay, so first uh, you need to copy this location. So uh, here I'm selecting there is the important things. So it's called that I'm selecting. So that here you must log in with the escort. Okay, so here you can see this is the escort. So after that, the next is let's paste to uh, the location and or uh, this place you need to give here the path at the rate then or uh, this place give the file name so file name is now escort one that i'm giving escort one and you need to give the types so type is now dot sql so when you execute to this query then you can get to this all those things okay so these things you can get here okay so why this uh, output to uh, that's coming because if i go inside the escort and or uh, there or uh, two queries are there so let's copy this to query and close the file then after paste there so if you so here you can see or uh, no rows selected so if i execute this query or uh, below query okay so here you can see there is no any rows or so that no rows selected and if I execute this query then you can get this all those things so total 13 so if I execute now you can see 13 rows selected and no rows selected so whatever the inside to or contents of the files according to that that's so the result this places okay and if you are going to use so this query so let's copy and this I'm going to use inside the inside the system or uh, schema so that uh, here you can see table out views that's not exit because uh, a scout one file that doesn't exit in the systems so if you're using system then you can get your systems okay after that the next is the same thing you can use so if you want then you can use your uh, this uh, uh, query uh, sorry this uh, file so what exactly you need to do so only copy this location and the uh, first thing is that you need to go on this HR so HR schema you need to go so this is here I think uh, HR schema is there so, so you can see this is the HR that's come there so copy this uh, uh, paste this location give the add, uh, add the rate and what exactly is the file name so file name is now hr dot hr so let's give here hr and give the and dot sql s q r after that let's execute this query so now you can see this all those things because these things or uh, that's uh, appearing because uh, inside the hr this three queries are there so this three queries according to the query this is the showing the result okay so this is how we can run the sql files and print the contents so i hope guys this video is the helpful for you so now in this video it's over so thanks for watching see you next week thank you